from the White House. Today, the White House is going Greek. It is the day that President Trump has invited Greeks and Greek Americans to celebrate Greek independence. Make Greece great again, right? right? On March 25th, 1821, Greek patriots rose up and fought to liberate their country. The president opens the White House to the Greek community to celebrate Greek independence. It's very special for me to be able to come back as a former employee of the White House. And of course, the party wouldn't do it without real life. Are you having a good time? Is everybody having a good time? This is Booksellers Room at the White House, and we have some Greek dancers. It's a great culture. They all want to be Greek, you know? The United States and all of Western civilization has been profoundly shaped by the extraordinary achievements of the Greek people stretching all the way back to ancient times. But this event has a long history, and we will find the Greeks that started it back in the years of President Reagan. Now, what we did 33 years ago, passed a resolution through the House and Senate establishing March 25th as Greek Independence Day. Then, we wanted to get the president to sign the document. So at the time, Reagan was president. Tom Corlogos is an old friend, helped get Reagan to sign. He liked the Greeks. President Reagan and I took him to Detroit, to Greek town, and he liked uh, the Sablaka, and we had a big thing for, uh, for a Greek day. And the other ones were done in the Rose Garden, with flowers and the uh, big press briefing, and, and it grew and grew and grew, and every president since has done it. And the thing like this in this government, in this White House, if the last guy did it, the next guy wants to do it better. Only two nationalities have met with every president every year for 30 years. That's the Irish, who are one out of nine, and the Greek Americans, who are one out of every 250. This evening, we also celebrate the countless ways Greek Americans strengthen and uplift and inspire our nation. You live by the values that are the foundation of America's greatness. You really do. This is uh, music from Greece, you know, from, from the Crayon Island. I want to thank you, God bless you, and again, I want to wish all of you a joyous Greek Independence Day.